Okay, hello and welcome back to this uh, sort of kind of mini-series here. Uh, in the last episode I showed you how to build the delivery truck, which is standing right next to me. And in this one I'm going to show you how to make a uh, food, uh, food stand sort of thing. I don't know what the exact term for them is, but they're basically uh, mobile food trucks. And uh, it's on the same general, I guess, platform you could say as the delivery truck. I mean, they look pretty much identical on first glance, but there are a couple of key differences, mainly in, uh, in that uh, it doesn't have the back door, there's going to be some stuff on the inside, a little service window, and some stuff like that. So, to start, let's go ahead and put in sort of a counter here. We're just going to do that three blocks wide across this little service window. And we're going to put in a step to access the inside. And now that we're working inside, we're going to go ahead and put one more block here. Let's just use ports. And then we're going to put the stove here and the sink here. And then next to that, we are going to put a and an empty flower pot and a brewing stand. So let me just go ahead and grab those. And uh, sorry if it's a bit loud in the background, the washing machine is going. I don't know if you can hear that, but uh, it's very loud on my end. So we're just going to go ahead and throw those in there. That's pretty much all there is to the inside. I mean, there isn't a whole lot of space for much more. So that's about it. As you can see in here, I already have a little steering wheel and stuff set up. And uh, as you can probably see I've already built the truck itself just because it's pretty much identical to this one. So with that having been taken care of, we've also done pretty much everything else, or I've also done pretty much everything else off camera. So we already have the wheels, taillights, headlights, and all that fun stuff. So now what we're gonna do is throw in some item frames and that's basically just gonna show the uh, merchandise here that we have. So we're gonna put in some water, some bread, and then basically all the different kinds of cooked meat. And there you go. That's pretty much it. And then we're gonna go ahead and do that on the other side. Let me just check here. Where exactly? Okay. Alright, so this, this, uh, variant here could be used to create a lot of different things. I mean, not a lot, a lot per se, but we could also make it into an ice cream truck, which I might actually do a video of. I don't know. I still have yet to figure out how exactly you'd go about uh, making the ice cream cone and all the stuff that uh, makes ice cream trucks as distinct as they are. I don't know. For some reason, these are always like coming in here all turned around. And, uh, yeah, anyway, like I said, I'm still kind of trying to figure out how to do, like, the cone and that sort of stuff, just to make it look more like an actual ice cream truck. But if I do get that figured out, and assuming somebody else doesn't jump on it before I do, I think uh, that'll probably be the next video of this little series. And, uh, as I said, this one is pretty much complete. Let me just go ahead and put in some more frames on the back here. Just for a bit of decor. There we go. Yeah, let's throw on another sign or license plate. Put that here. I guess this will be fruity. There you go, fruity. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, without me rambling on and uh, artificially extending the length of this video, or unnecessarily, I guess I should say. Uh, we're pretty much done here. <laughs> Not really used to my let's build and such being so quick and concise, but yeah, that's about it. That's really all there is to show. Uh, thanks for tuning in. Be sure to uh, you know watch some of my other videos and such if they uh, look like they'd be interesting to you. And if you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like or a comment or subscribe or what have you. If not, then please feel free to leave some constructive criticism. Again, thank you for watching, and uh, hopefully I will see you next time.